Hello and welcome to me, Tara L. Today we're going to be doing your weekly reading. So let's just give these cards a good shuffle here and we'll get right into it for you. See what uh, your week has brings forward. See what the cards bring forward for you this week. <coughs> okay. Excuse me. <coughs> First card you have is the Nine of Wands here. This is going to be your main card for this week here. It's looking as though you're on the outside. You're on the outside and you're protecting something from within. And, uh, I'm, alright. I'm having a feeling this year protecting your heart. You're protecting your heart. Um, protecting your heart, and you may be having some a lot of stress and anxiety over it because your head you have your head your head bandaged, but you're on the outside. You're on the outside of what of a uh, you're guarding your heart on. You know what I'm saying. Um, It's so as as you as you're you're it's as though you you know behind this fence behind this fence here is what is uh what is really trouble what is really troubling troubling you is is somewhere that that you can't reach is what I'm getting at is there something that's troubling your heart that that you can't reach feeling perhaps like you've been locked out it's giving you a lot of stress and anxiety um. And, and you keep in your keep you keep looking back at that. You keep looking back. So what are you looking back at? Look, you're looking back. You're looking back at the King of Cups here. King of Cups. Uh, kings are of authority. He's the authority of the emotions. Like I was saying, you know you. You're blocking your heart here. You're blocking your heart. There's something that's troubling you that, that you can't seem to uh, get on the other side of. And the king is coming forward, though. Is he, you know, he, he's, he's, let's just say, the master of emotions. Um... And he's, he's coming forward and telling you, you know, don't let the rocky waters, don't let the rocky waters, don't let the rocky ro waters and the, and the monsters um, that are lying within your head here, you know, you have your head, you have your head on a bandage here. Don't let your thoughts, don't let the, your emotional thoughts control you. Don't let them control you. As you can tell, he is sitting in the middle of the ocean here. Not a care in the world, right? He doesn't care that this there's this big old whale here and all these rolling waves. He's in control. So the king's coming forward telling you to keep your emotions intact. Keep yourself in control. Um, and he is, you know, you know, you can tell, you know, he's really trying to be very a power a lot of authority and power over this because he's staring right at you. And you you're you guys you are making eye contact. You're making eye contact. You know, you're gonna have to, you know, you're gonna be under, you're gonna be understanding this in a short, in a short while. The understanding of why you're, um, why you're feeling as though you're being left out or blocked out. It's going to, uh, you know, there's gonna be, there's gonna be an answer for you. There will be an answer for you. Um, it's like you're using a telepathy here, telepathy going on here, and the the king also uh, has these ear flaps on, which is all for uh, inner hearing. You know, listen, listen to your heart, listen to listen to the true self. Don't let don't get these don't let these emotions control you. 
Well, put down, put those ear flaps on like this king here. Cover your ears. <laughs> cover your ears. Um, you know, don't cover your ears and don't listen. Don't listen to your inner thoughts that's causing this anxiety with this head bandage on you, keeping you trapped, keeping you trapped uh, from a, on the other side of this gate here, onto what um, what you're going for there. Because if see, it's just going to tear you down. It'll just, it'll just keep knocking you down and knocking you down and knocking you down. You don't want to be this ten of swords. You know, you don't want to be in this position of the ten of swords. You don't want to be down and out. You don't want to be down and out. Tens are for completion, though. The sun is starting to rise, raise. The sun is starting to raise here. Um... So the sun is coming up. The sun is coming up out of the horizon. The black clouds are starting to drift away in this here picture. Um, but you have been knocked down. You know, you, you've been knocked down. But uh, don't let that stress you out too much, though, because the sun is coming up again, and you will rise up. You know, you will rise up and, and perhaps be a little stronger. But why even, you know, but why even let yourself get to this point? You know, take the... Take the advice from the king. Get the emotions under control. Listen to your inner self. Listen to your insight. Your intuition. That's what this king is about. Intuition and emotions. Yeah. Let's see what falls between the, the king and uh, this nine of wands here. To have the page of swords. The page of swords is now coming in. Very enthusiastic. It's very enthusiastic. Very enthusiastic. Young at heart. Okay, he's young at heart. He also has his face. He's also looking back. He's looking back at this King of Cups as well. See this here? He's looking back. Oops, I'm sorry. I got that wrong. He's also looking back at this. He's also looking about at this King. So it's about communication. A very enthusiastic, communicative, uh, Ambitious person, ambition, a lot of ambition here. Enthusiastic ambition. I'm looking at this king. Knight of Swords is rushing. Now the Knight of Swords is rushing in too, and he's also riding towards the past. He's also riding towards this King of Cups here. He's the fastest one of them all. He's the most powerful knight. Did I say king? I did. He's the most powerful knight. He takes no. Sh he takes. Let's just say he takes no shit from no one. He speaks his mind, and he doesn't think though before he moves. Before he takes action. Okay. He doesn't think before he takes action. And and he's zooming, he's zooming right back. He's zooming. You know, he's he's gonna just fly right, he's just gonna ride and fly right past this uh, right past this uh, page of, you know, to get to this to get to this king here. He's gonna pass right up this enthusiastic, ambitious page. This this is boisterous. No shit taken night though is saying uh oh, no no. We gotta get something straight. Something has to be learned here. We gotta get the advice from this king of emotions. So and you have the temperance. Temperance is coming in now. Right underneath the ten of swords. Like I was saying. You know, it doesn't need, you don't need to go that route. You don't need to go this route to end up like, 
you know, the Ten of Swords down in your luck, all the way broken down to start from fresh and rebuild yourself up. Temperance is coming in. She's showing you, you know, she's showing you and wants to bring forward to you the to give you the balance and the and the clarity and the clarity, you know. Um, you know this is a, just like you know, she's an angel. So in other words, an angel. You know, she's the angel. She's coming down and wants to give you, wants to give you uh, that knowledge. Wants to give you the knowledge of this this king here, that 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 you you just keep referring. You just keep referring back to this. So something must have been very emotional here with breaking your heart. Like I said in the very beginning with this here. But you know that the temperance, you know, she's coming in. She's coming. The sun is rising up between these two pill um, between these two mountains. And the sun is rising up out of these mountains. You gotta climb the mountains to learn. Climb the mountains to learn. The sun is rising up, coming up, gonna be shining up and over those two mountains. She has these two cups in her hands. You know, she's keeping balance. She's taking emotions and, you know, kind of like grounding herself. She's pouring the water from one cup to the other. You know, keeping herself in balance. The angels are on your side, okay? The angels are on your side. The sun is rising. The sun is rising here. You know, these, these cards, these... You know, these are all about, like I said, it's action. Communication and action. These, this knight and this page is just rushing. I keep going to keep saying it. Rushing to this king. And this, you know, the, what's ever going on with you, with, a, I don't know, a relationship or whatever you're feeling like you're trapped on the other side of here. Um, you know, you have, the, you have the beautiful temperance here, this angel coming into you, you know, wants to give rid of you that insight and that knowledge, that intuition, um, so you don't end up, so you don't get stuck here, you know, you don't have, get stuck here, learn what you need to learn and move on, that's what the angel is saying, you want to be on, you want to take this clear, you want to start this path here, go to these mountains where it's beautiful, and, uh, where the sun is all is shining up, going to be shining upon you, you know, with the glory and the light, the angel, right? Okay, so that was your reading, and uh, have a great one. See you again.